Today we are running an exercise here in our integrated tower working position simulator. The main point we uh, try to cover here in this facility is that we want to integrate for the controller a lot of the devices they currently have on different displays into one display. We then add on all these alerts and conflict warnings that are possible with a technology where the controllers use electronic devices for inputting their clearances. So we have routing alerts, we have opposite routes, uh, deadlock alerts, we have uh, runway incursion alerts, runway crossing alerts and several others for late landing clearance for instance. The important thing for us is of course the runway safety as such. This is one of the most sensitive uh, areas uh, all over the world where accidents still happen. We have invited controllers but also other people responsible for the implementation of advanced surveillance and conflict warning systems from countries mainly outside of our CESAR partners such as Hangoro Control, Belgo Control, Luxembourg, ANA, Avinor in Norway, LFV in Sweden but also air traffic control in Dubai has been here and uh, we are very proud and pleased that they all wanted to come. People who come here find this very interesting. We spend about two hours on theory and then we demonstrate with our instructors for one hour. After that we actually let the participants have a hands-on interactive experience in our simulator. And it turns out that even people who are not controllers can quite quickly and intuitively grasp what this is all about and start interacting with the system on an airport that they have actually never worked at or seen before.